jump on wing for my queen. You gon' wait me till Jesus come. Quiet when I talk. Pocket full flows. Money, honey. Forget about Suzanne. So since we don't have all the equipment like you know cameras and all this stuff, so just use one of the uh, webcam from my, my my computer. So we're gonna start with these tools and give people knowledge because that's how they say you know start with what you have, what you have. and then from there you're gonna add a battery, you know you're gonna add a battery and things gonna propagate it and you know excuse me and things gonna improve slowly you know because you can't reach down top before it's on the bottom otherwise then you're gonna break and start from bottom of right so you want to start to travel to south africa or motherland and you don't want to have a problem when you arrive to motherland south africa in the old tambo from the old tambo to the village to the town to the city from cape town to johannesburg to the eastern cap and all the part of south africa let's get now to the business so now uh this is the second uh lesson for uh how to speak easy closer it's in closer. So if you don't say like, why do I say it's in closer? You should go back to my previous video. Like I say, whenever you have a X, let's say X A, you pronounce it cha cha. So if it's X E, that's it cha cha. X E E E. If it's X O O. If it's X U O. For example, take more example. For example. You have something. Ooh, yeah. Toka means you lie. So you see, if it's X and H, let's say this one, you're gonna have to click harder. Ha, ha, ha. See, so this is Ooh, yeah. Toka means you lie. When you use Ooh, yeah, means you, for you, for you. So Ooh, yeah. Toka. Toka means to lie. So Ooh, yeah. Oka, uya, oka, uya, oka, uya, oka. You lie, uya, oka. Oh, I'm not lying. So if you want to say I'm not lying, trust me. You say Andy. So Andy means is opposite, like you. Okay, quickly, excuse me. That's what we're gonna do today because we're gonna learn how to use D and Andy. So D means you do or you agree is for me. For example. Diafuna means I want. Diafuna. Funa means to want. So when you say dia means I, I am, I do want, I do. D means for me, but I want you to do something. When you do means when I'm doing. Let me say when I do, when I'm doing, when I'm doing. So I say D. For example, diafuna means I want. Diafunu kuteta nawe, diafunu kuteta nawe. I want to talk to you, diafunu kuteta nawe. Diafunu kuteta nawe, diafunu kuteta nawe. So diafuna means I want. For example, diafunu kuteta nawe. Diafunu kuteta nawe. Means I want to talk to you. Teta means to talk. Teta means to talk. Diafuna kuteta, diafuna kuteta nawe. Kuteta nawe. I want to talk to you. Diafunu kuteta nawe. Right, so let's say find a sound example. Uh, Dieza, I'm coming. Dieza, I'm coming. Dieza, Dieza, Dieza. Can you see? So when you want to use about uh, you, when you want to talk about me, 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 you must use D. Dieza, I am coming. Dieza, I'm coming. Dieza. So now let's see how we can oppose. If you oppose every this sentence, you must say and and it means you oppose. For example, Dieza, I'm coming. So if you want to say I'm not coming, you're gonna say and easy. And easy means I'm not coming. For example, when you say and easy means I'm not coming. I'm not coming. A good example. I bo. Uyeza is calling. It means are you coming to school? Uyeza is calling. Aibo man, and this is calling. Inam tlange. Means I'm not coming to school today. Efeto. Uyeza is calling. Uyeza is calling. Inam tlange. Are you coming to school today? Ah ah. Mm mm. Mm mm. Means no. Mm mm. 
And this is college and I'm slanging, miss. No, I'm not coming to school today. I'm not coming to school today. In fact, we are in South Africa. Hey, my friend, are you coming to South Africa? We are in South Africa in December. Are you coming to South Africa in December? Mm -mm. And this is in South Africa in December. I'm not coming to South Africa in December. In fact, booty, miss brother. Booty, brother, booty. Uyeza ikapa, uyeza ikapa ngo December. Brother, are you coming to Cape Town December? Ewe, miss, yes. Ewe, miss, yes. Ewe, ndieza. Yes, I am coming. Ewe, ndieza. Ndiewe, miss, yes. Ndieza. Ndieza, miss, ndi you agree. Ndieza. Ikapa, I'm coming to Cape Town. Dieza a cab, I'm coming Cape Town. See, 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 means for see, see, see. We as a, we as a cab, we as a cab. Eh, we, Dieza a cab. Yes, I'm coming to Cape Town. Mm mm, mm mm, means no. Mm mm, when you say mm mm, meaning no. Mm mm, and easy. No, I'm not coming. And easy means I'm not coming. And means you oppose. Okay, for example, Diafuna, I want. So if you want to say I don't want, you say Andy Funi means I don't want Andy. Andy Funi. Dia Ifuna means I want it. You see the sample when you say I want means you're not specifying. But when you say I want it means you want something. So you must say Dia Fun, Dia Ifuna. See there's the I here, Dia Ifuna. Means I want it. That I means it make a difference of what I mean. This sentence, you want something specified. I don't want it. And the I don't want it. See, let's come here. Dizo m e e. Dizo m elela. Elela means to tell. So dizo m elela. I will tell him or her. Dizo m elela. I'm gonna tell him or her. So if you don't want to say, I'm not gonna tell him. And dizo and dizo means you say you put a here. You say I'm not gonna tell her or him. And dizo. I'm not gonna tell him or her. And this is Elena. Booty. Oh, see, see the hamba now. Hey, go. Oh, hey, sister. I'm gonna go with you. You know. <laughs> oh, see, see the hamba now. I'm gonna go with you. The hamba. Hamba means go. Hamba man means go man. Sometimes you tell somebody, hey, please leave me alone. Just go. Let's say, hey, hamba man. Dieke. Dieke means like leave me alone. Dieke means mm -hmm. leave me alone. Dieke. Let me write here so you. Dieke means leave me alone. Dieke. 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 Emma, dieke, man. Ish. Means leave me alone. You know, so you gotta get those accents and play around like how to talk, you know, the right accent. I'm a dieke, man. Ish. We are so cool. Means leave me alone. You disturb me. Dieke means you are so cool. Leave me alone. You bother me. You disturb me. She. This she means so cold. Dieke means leave me alone. On this she means leave me. We are so cold. We are so cold. Means you bother me or you disturb me. Please, ma. They are going to tell and do home fed. I'm begging you. They are going to tell. Means I'm begging you. I'm asking you politely. They are going to tell. Means they are going to tell. D D ya ku tela D ya ku tela means I'm begging you D she D ya ku tela and D she I'm I'm asking you polite please leave me alone D she on the egg leave me alone D ya ku tela means I'm asking you polite I'm asking you D, you see, it's for me. Means you, you, you the one who means you the one who's saying. Diaku tela means I'm asking you. Oh, like I'm back. I'm asking you, please. Diake, leave me alone. Diake, diake, leave me alone. Diake, leave me alone. So you can connect these two by saying diaku tela, diaku tela, diake man. Please, I'm asking you, leave me alone. See, so that's how uh, you how to use some of the words. You know what I'm saying? Another thing, quick. 
if you see CA on a previous lesson we did, if you see CA, we say, ha, 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 ha. If you see E, A, A, A. If you see O, 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 see you, O, O, see. We did that on a previous lesson, so you can go back to my previous video. So that's why here I say, Diaku, Ela. Diaku, Ela. I'm begging you, I'm asking you. Right, so let's come here. Dieke means leave me alone. Dieke, leave me alone. Uyeza ngoko. Uyeza ngoko means are you coming now? So try to get with the X in the house. speak. Uyeza ngoko means you ask. You can say uyeza ngoko. Like it don't make sense. Know what I'm saying? You have to say uyeza ngoko means are you coming? Are you still coming, man? Or you coming, brother? Or you coming, sister? Or you coming? Uyeza ngoko. Eh, eh. Yes. Eh, we. Yes. Ndiyeza ngoko. Eh, we. Ndi. Eh, we. Ndi. Yeza. Yes. I'm coming. Eh, eh. Ewe means yes. Ndiyeza, I'm coming. Ngoku. Now. Ngoku means now. Ngoku. Ngoku means now. Ngoku. Ngoku. Means now. For example. Wenzani ngoku. Wenzani ngoku. What are you doing now? Wenzani ngoku. Ah, dia funda ngoku. Means I'm starting. Dia lala. I'm playing. Dia lala. Lala. Means to play. Lala, lala means to play. Lala. So if you see D and L, you pronounce it. <laughs> Dia lala, lala means to play. So lala to play. So if you want to say I am playing, you say D. Dia lala, I am playing. Dia lala. Let me write big a little bit so you can see. Dia lala. Dia lala means I'm playing. So if you want to say I'm not playing, you must do andi, andi lali. I'm not playing. Andi lali. I'm not playing. Andi lali fit. Andi lali means I'm not playing. Andi lali. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Okay, you want to tell somebody, hey, you waste my time, or you waste time, you waste time. Say, Udlala na lintesha. Udlala na lintesha. Udlala na lintesha when I miss you. Play with the time. You waste time, bro. Oh, you waste time, sister. Udlala na lintesha. Means you waste the time. I'm going to write here. Let me write here. Udlala na lintesha. Why udlala na lintesha? Say, so why do you waste my time? Why you waste your time? Let's say, kuteni. Kuteni means like a why. Kuteni. Kuteni, man. Kuteni, man. When I like, kuteni, when I, when I means you. Kuteni, when I, ulala, na, linkesha. Ulala, I see, D-L, U-D-L-A means to play. Lala. La la say la la to play. Kute ni win u la la u la la na link ish na link ish u la la ne link ish ne link isha link isha means time link isha meaning time so kute ni win na u la kute ni means why kute ni means why kute ni win na Means you. Why you? Lala nelin kesha. Lala. Why you play with time? Kuche. Hey, Fred. Kuche ni wana lala nelin kesha. Aunam sebenzi oku okwenzi. Means why you waste the time? You don't have a job. Aunam sebenzi. You don't have a what? Aunam zi responsibility, Fred. You don't have a responsibility? Shini. Sebenzi, man. Means work, Fred. You must have some attitude when you speak this language, man. With a flossy way. Kuteni when out lala na lintesha man fit. Why you waste your time, eh? Sebenza. Work. Sebenza means work. Sebenza means work. So this part here, man, is very clear, man. So now we go for, you know, for the second part. You see, now I create a lot of mess here, man. So let's do this. Oh, just to separate. Okay, cool. So now we want to see now 
how we can use uh we as a go means are you coming and easy i'm not coming and the okay i'm not lying and the army i'm not going and the okay i'm not andy means you oppose and easy i'm not coming so now let's see now how we can use ba m u ya and um for example let's see how we can use ba so let's see how we can use ba ba is when you use for other people for example you say they do something they so you must use ba for example ba pambeni means so this is for is it closer ba pambeni means they are crazy or they're getting crazy are they crazy so oh man they are crazy or they're crazy but pambeni abantu means these people are crazy but pambeni but i never use this word because it's very rude so but pambeni means they're crazy abantu bantu means people abantu bantu means people so you say but pambeni abantu means they're crazy these people you know probably maybe for some reason they were supposed to do some stuff or they do crazy stuff you say hey bapambeni abantu ne are these people crazy bapambeni abantu bapambeni upambeni wena means are you crazy upambeni u means for you upambeni ne upambeni ne ne is like uh huh uh huh mm -hmm. yeah uh huh upambeni wena ne upambeni wena ne 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 is like uh huh yo yo what's up oh Upambeni wena ne? Upambeni means are you crazy? So for the other people you say ba pambeni. So this is for isi tosa. But for isi sulu you say ba ya shanya. It does mean the same thing. Ba ya shanya. Why we say there? Because they say H and L. Ba ya shanya bantu. These people are crazy. But the Timaliam, they took my money. Imali means money. Imali. Imali means money. Imali. Meaning money. But Pambene Abandu. But Pambene means the crazy. So if you want to tell somebody, uh, you, you confuse me. You say, Uyandi Pambanis. Uyandi Pambanis. In fact, Uyandi man. So this is for Zulu. Uyandi Sanyisa means you. Confuse me, we are disanisa. Will you confuse me? Or we are dipambanisa for horse. We are dipambanisa means you confuse me, you drive me crazy. For example, you might tell your girlfriend or your wife or whatever, like, stand up, stand up. serious. If you get a yanisa, like, hey, my wife, my baby, I mean, your figures drive me crazy. Stand up, stand up. If you get a means your figure drive me crazy or if figure yako iandi pambanis means your figure it drive me crazy but if you in uh, element school middle school please don't use this stuff until you grow up is when you can start to use this word right now let's go mshie is leaving for one person so you see so you see the difference this is for singular but this is for plural and it's for them so if you use m is used for me or you what you're doing for example mshie excuse me no 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 my apologies i made a mistake here so sorry when you use m is for them but for one person for example you want to tell them like uh leave him open for him so use m for example mshie means uh leave him or leave her but when you say bashie means is when you want to do something but for a lot of people bashie means leave them bashie leave them bashie bagoboze bashie bago bagoboze bashie bagoboze let them talk let them gossip let them say all this room about us or whatever they want to say bashie bagoboze let them gossip let them say all the rumor tina tina means us sipezulu stand up we up. I mean, we do a thing in a great way. So, Tina, us, Tina means us. Sipezulu, stand or some. Stand or some is like my baby or your love. So, it's a, but it must be your girlfriend or your, if you, or your husband or whatever. If you have your husband, your girlfriend. So, you use that one. I'm saying, Bashie bangoboze. Kungoboza means to gossip or say all the rumor about somebody. Bashie bangoboze, Tina, Sipezulu, stand or some. 
as we up pezulu means pezulu means top or top si pezulu tina si pezulu stano sa so if you want to use like we you use c c c for example si hamba ngoku means we going si yafunda means we study si yafunda si yafunda means we study si yafunda we study si yafunda we study let them gossip we are baby for we are bashi bangoboze tina sipambili stand up we front we right there in front of them tina sipambili pambili means front ya bona you may tell someone that you know the pambili ngoko me i'm in front you say your wife your girlfriend ish upambili stand up means you right in front see stuff like that now let's go for the next one uyandiva means can you hear me uyandiva fetu uyandiva fetu means can you hear me uyandiva can you hear me si uya uya means when you tell for next page of life do you do do uyapi uyapi where are you going uyapi where are you going uyapi where are you going upi means where are you Upi means where are you? Uyapi. Uyapi. Where are you going? Upi. Where are you? See? Uyandiva fit. Uyandiva fit. So, Uyandiva means can you hear me? Uyandiva. Can you hear me? See? Uyapi fit means where are you going? Fit is like a brother. Uyapi sisi means where are you going, my sister? Mfeto means for brother so we are different fate means can you hear me can you hear me can you hear me we are different fate means can you hear me ewe ndia kuva ewe ndia kuva yes i can hear you ewe ndia kuva ewe ndia kuva ndia kuva can somebody try here ewe means yes ndia kuva i can hear you we and even fit. We and even sis. Can you hear me? Abandivi. They don't hear me. See, aba means it's for them. For a lot of them. But if it's him or her, you say, mm. See, so uh, aba, aba, divi. They don't hear me. Abandivi means they don't hear me. Aba funi means they don't want. Uya. So how we use uya? Uya is for one person. Like, do you? U, do you? Uya posisa means you lie. So there's a different place. Uh, the two words got the same meaning, but you have a, you're using different time. If you say uya, uya oka means you lie too. But when you say uya oka, this is uh, you uh, in also language like you so meaning with it, like you somebody you a liar or you lie. So when you say this on your posisa, it's kind of a polite way. Like ah, come on, man. Uh, this is not true, man. It must be some suspicious time, or you know, like you tell somebody, mm, no, I don't trust this. This is not. It's not like trust. Like it's kind of lie. But when you say uya, oka means you so meaning to it. Like you know, you're such a liar. You know what I'm saying? So there's a two. So that's how you use in different time. Like if you're not too meaning with it, you can say uya possess. Like you know, ah, come on, man. That's not true. It's not. Mm -mm. If I say it's not true, it's not gonna make a great sense because there's other way we use. But just know. This one is so meaning like you know what you lie. So you say we are okay. But if you say nah, you lie. You see? We are oh, we are pussies. We are pussies. So listen here, man. You know, if this video was very helpful and you learn from me, do not forget to subscribe. Forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, dear. Who subscribe channel yam? Who kumbule go subscribe channel yam? Remember, who kumbule? We andiva, we andiva fetu, we andiva sis. Eh eh. Who subscribe channel yam? Me bone ne. Eh eh. And then zoku nige indo imnandi. And then I'm gonna give you something nice. Di zoku nige, I'm gonna give you into something imnandi, something great, something nice. 
Sharp sharp bye bye. Sizo di bana next time. Sizo di sizo bonana later. Bye bye. Sharp sharp. Okay, well, thanks a lot. Thanks for time, Lisa. Thanks a lot. Appreciate. Peace and love. Peace and love. Peace. Peace. My queen, you want when me so Jesus come? Why when I talk? Pocket full flows, money, honey. Forget about Susan. So since we don't have all the equipment like you know cameras and all this stuff, so just use one of the uh, webcam from my my, my computer.